Before we start the video, I thought I would share uh, something that came in the mail today. People have seen this before. This is my big reel of 0 0.01 microfarad capacitors. It's on uh, tape and reel. I bought this at a flea market once and there were 7,500 capacitors. So <laughs> I have a lifetime, a lifetime supply of those, of these uh, tape and reel capacitors. But what came, in the, what came in the mail today was a couple more reels. And uh, these are resistors. So this is a reel of 10K, a 10K resistors. And this is a reel of 1K resistors. So yeah, my favorite values. So somebody on, on eBay had these and I don't know why they're getting rid of them so cheap. I got uh, the 1Ks for 99 cents <laughs> and I got the 10Ks for five bucks. And I've gone back and looked to see if he had other ones, and he's raised all of his prices to twelve fifty now. So <laughs> maybe twelve fifty is still okay. But uh, he said these were lead free, so maybe that's true. Yeah, they're uh, stack pole. What are these? Stack pole. That looks like a uh, label from uh, DigiKey. Uh, look free. I wonder if these, uh, huh, I wonder if these solder are okay. Let me, uh, let me snip off a few and, uh, see if they, uh, if they solder easily. I think even if they're lead free, they're probably, they'll probably still solder to them. But, uh, yeah, let's, uh, move, uh, I'll move the camera over and we'll give these, uh, give these a go. Quarter watt, 5% carbon film. Uh, these are carbon film. Interesting. Anyway, I have a lifetime supply of these. 5,000 of the 1K and 5,000 of the other one. So, uh, make good Christmas presents. All right, let's see if, uh, if these solder easily or not. Yeah, I'd solder. They solder very easily. So, yeah, no problem there. All right. Um, okay, I've got lots of resistors. All right. All right, here's a good guessing game. I've made a uh, triangle with three resistors, and then I made a little pentagon, or pentagon, a um, pyramid. I made a pyramid with three other resistors. Right? I think pyramids are four-sided, but whatever, you know, you know, I get the idea here. It's like a, uh, is this a... Uh, methane? I think methane looks like this, right? It's uh, three, three over here and, and, and one over here. So three, three, three. It's always three no matter way, which, whichever way you want to look at it. And then if we measure the uh, resistance across one of the, uh, one of the resistors, what do you think it's going to be? Okay, these are all 10Ks. 10K, 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 10K. Uh, so we know that things are going to be in parallel and series, and we got a lot more than 10K. So I'll give it away the first hint. It's going to be lower than 10K because <laughs> some things in uh, some things in parallel with the 10K that we already have. So I'm going to put that in my little test fixture here to hold everything. There we go. All right. So make your guesses now. There's no cheating. Do not do the math. Okay, let's see, we've got, uh, on one triangle, we've got 20K in parallel with 10K, and then that's in parallel with another 20K, a 20K. So let's see, I'm gonna make a guess. I'm gonna say it's uh, uh, 3K. <laughs> that's my guess, 3K. All right, let's see how you did. Yep, 4.99, 4.9K. So if you guessed 4.9K, very good.